Good day everyone. So for today, ang aaralin natin is all about infinite geometric series. In our previous video tutorials, meron tayo ng mga examples of how to use a uh, formula for geometric series. So this time, meron naman tayong tinatawag na infinite geometric series. So ang tanong, paano mo ba malalaman kung ang isang uh, geometric sequence is infinite or not? Okay. So, ganito yun. So, let's say I have here a geometric sequence 1, 1 half, 1 fourth, 1 eighth, 1 16, then dot, dot, dot. Okay. So, paano natin malalaman na itong given na geometric uh, sequence na ito ay gagamitan natin ng infinite geometric series or yung usual na geometric series. Okay, so ganito siya. Okay, so always remember na we will use infinite geometric series if okay, so if and only if and okay, your R is less than 1. Okay. Or to be specific, the absolute value of R is less than 1. So, pag sinabi natin absolute value, so, um, ito yung taking the uh, positive. Okay? So, kung negative man siya, so, pag kinuha may absolute value, so, magiging positive pa rin siya. Okay? So, less than 1. Meaning, ang pag sinabing less than 1, um, syempre, it could be fractions. Okay? So, ayan. So, check ngayon natin itong given na uh, geometric se sequence na ito kung pasok ba ito sa infinite geometric series so check muna natin yung r kasi yun yung magiging basis natin so ang gagawin natin ay kukunin natin yung value ng r ayan so ang mayayari magiging 1 half so r is equals to okay so 1 half over 1 so that is equals to 1 half Okay, sunod naman. R is equals to 1 fourth over Okay, so isin natin. So that is 1 fourth over 1 half. So what is 1 fourth over 1 half? So magiging numerator divided by numerator that is 1. 4 divided by 2, so that is 2. So 1 half. So, next naman, check natin. R is equals to 1 over 8 over 1 over 4. So, same lang. Numerator, yung numerator, divide mo sa numerator. So, that is 1 over yung denominator, divide mo sa denominator. 8 divided by 2, 4 is 2. Okay? So, kung mapapansin natin, yung ating common ratio R is equals to 1 half. So, ang tanong, yung bang R natin is... Um, or the absolute value ba ng R natin, which is 1 half, is less than 1? So, the answer is yes. Kasi, 1 half is less than 1. So, ano ngayon ang gagawin natin kapag ganyan? So, i-introduce naman natin ngayon yung another formula na gagamitin natin for infinite um, geometric series. And that is, S infinity that is equal to A sub 1 over 1 minus R. So, ito lang yung formula natin. Okay. So, paano ngayon natin masasolve yung sum nito? So, simple lang. Okay. So, ang gagawin natin ay ganito. S infinity equals to what is A sub 1? So, obvious naman yung A sub 1 natin is 1. Over 1 minus ano yung R natin? So, ito nakuha na natin. Which is 1 half. So, simplify, magiging 1 over 1 div minus 1 half is also 1 half. Okay. So, pag kinuha na natin yan, di-reciprocal lang natin yung, ano, yung denominator na 1 half. So, S infinity will become 2. So, yun pala ang final answer natin. Or pag kinuha pala natin yung sum ng infinite geometric series na ito, the answer will be 2. Okay. So, and another example for infinite geometric series. So, basta remember, 
uh, kapag infinite geometric series, yung R dapat laging less than 1. Okay? Yung absolute value of R must be less than 1. Okay? So, another example tayo. So, let's say I have here uh, 1 half, 1 fourth, 1 over 8, 1 over 16, 1 over 32, dot, dot, dot. Okay. So, the first thing we need to do is, first is, let's check the common ratio if R, or the, if the absolute value of R is less than 1. So, if yes, then we can consider this as an infinite geometric series. Okay, so check natin. So, R, that is equal to 1 fourth over 1 half. So, that is equal to 1 divided by 1, that is 1, over 4 divided by 2, that is 2. Okay. So, next, R is equals to 1 over 8 divided by 1 over 4. So, that is 1 divided by 1, that is 1, over 8 divided by 4, that is 2. So, if I'm going to continue this one, makikita ko, mapapansin ko na ang common ratio ko is 1 half. And that is less than 1. So, therefore, I can now use the formula for infinite geometric series. So, that will become S infinity that is equal to A sub 1 over 1 minus R. So, ang aking A sub 1 is given na 1 half. Okay. So, 1 half over 1 minus R is also 1 half. So, simplifying further, I will have 1 half over okay, 1 half. So, what is 1 half over 1 half? Okay. So, ang ating final answer will become S infinity that is equals to 1. Okay? Kasi 1 half divided by 1 half that is equal to 1. Okay. So, that's it for our uh, topic about infinite geometric series.